Separate facts from the fiction. Lift pussy what's under your engine. Any who we in that we flexing. Try fast, got a nasty addiction. Separate facts from the fiction. Lift pussy what's under your engine. Any who we in that we flexing. Try fast, got a nasty addiction. Chicago to Yabaco, while we wildin', you know we riding. Do it for the fam back on the island. Go so hard, we ain't playing, I promise. MR2, you know how we do. Custom made everything brand new. Hit a red right before the burn. Pullin' off like a scab when he make the turn. Hey, like we fine. Hey everybody, welcome to another episode of Nasty Addiction Garage. So, I don't know if you guys uh, have been checking out my uh, reels or any of my Instagram information um, or uh, profiles, just because uh, you guys then have seen a couple reels that I've put together that might uh, interest you guys. So, one of them being that uh, it was a box that I picked up from the post office. So, this box uh, is coming from Ukraine. Most of you guys have seen my uh, Facebook post about something that I, I, I ended up posting. Uh, and I got a lot of comments on and stuff like that. And I told you guys that I will be making a video soon. So, I am. Right now, this is the intro. So, guys, there's a box right behind me. I don't know if I'm catching it. But that box right there uh, just came in from Ukraine, guys. So, this is going to be another unboxing. All right, everybody, here goes the box that I did pick up from the post office. Um, I'm super excited about this box because this box is not going to go actually to uh, the green MR2. It's actually going to go to the 94 that I got in my backyard. And, and just kind of give you guys a little update on uh, how that 94 is doing. It's kind of defrosting at the moment. Uh, we have it back here. Uh, I just recently actually ripped my car cover uh, trying to take the snow off of it. But as you see, it's defrosting um, and it is uh, still under the cover. We really haven't done anything to this one just because uh, I don't have the room inside the garage to do it. So uh, it's been sitting out here for quite some time now. I put the, the cover in the description in case you guys were uh, at all interested. But back to this box. Um, I'm super excited because it's for the 94, like I said. Um, let's dive into this box. You guys know how this goes. Uh, I'm going to put you guys on the uh, camera stand, and I'm going to uh, do a little time lapse of me opening it, and then we'll talk more about the parts once I get them out. Uh, but let's dive into this box, guys, and let's go. Guys, this is the exhaust, the exhaust for the fifth gen that I'm going to be building for the 94. Um, I am just super excited. Again, this is from Victor um, at Sora Performance in Ukraine, guys. This guy does phenomenal jobs. Uh, I, I can't say nothing bad about the guy. He is a great individual, but back to the exhaust. This is something so phenomenal, guys. So I haven't even fully unwrapped it, uh, but as you guys can see, like these welds are looking really good. Uh, everything looks really nice, and I, I really can't wait just to display this uh, and put this on the, uh, the 94. So what I'm going to do right now, I'm going to actually... Uh, uh, start unwrapping this. I'm going to put you guys back on the camera stand and I just really want to start unwrapping this and, and checking it out. This thing is phenomenal. I at least want to just bolt it up together so it's all in one piece. Um, I'm not going to bolt down the, down the the long pipe, I guess, down pipe, I don't know, uh, the extra <laughs> to, uh, to it or anything. I'm just going to bolt these two together and just see how formation looks. But I'm going to remove all this first and we're going to go do it together, guys. So hold on.
as for our performance, uh, guys, this this has been built off of a template. Obviously, the cars have been here uh, in Chicago uh, the whole time, but he built this, Victor built this off of a template uh, that he built many years ago. Um, I think he said 10 years ago for an MR2 exhaust that he had built. Uh, but this one is specifically directly made for my MR2. So this was a custom build, but he built it off of the template um, that it's, uh, you know, that it was, he made for the standard like fitment for an exhaust on, uh, on a 94SW20 uh, MR2. So, um, like I, this, like I said, this is this is a phenomenal exhaust. So it's 80 millimeters. So meaning, uh, pipes are running 80 millimeters. It's a direct flow, so it's going to be directly to the downpipe of the turbo. Um, but what I'm going to do, this is going to need a little bit of modification, just because I don't know exactly where I'm going to be sitting the turbo. Based on the exhaust manifolds uh, that Victor made for me, I think that's what he's basing this off of. So if it is that then what this is what we're going to be doing so this is going to fit directly uh if not it'll take some slight modifications i'm not too too worried about it but guys let's let's take a deeper look at this check it out this has so much so much fucking ingenuity in it and i'm like i am ecstatic to to rock this exhaust just because this exhaust is going to be uh probably an eye catcher uh a nice eyepiece is probably going to sound nice as well um on the uh on the 94, on the 5th gen, 3S GTE. Uh, I'm still debating if I really want to run a blow-off valve or not, uh, just so I can enhance that, that turbo flutter. Um, I really, really like that sound, and I fell in love with it on the red um, 91 that I built, that was a 5th gen as well, that had the Apexy uh, N1 exhaust that we put on it. That sound great without a blow-off valve, and I, I kind of fell in love with that, so this is definitely what I might be doing with this. So guys, check this out. What you guys just seen was a 80 millimeter, 80 millimeter direct flow 3S GTE fifth gen exhaust. Um, this is what we're going to be putting on the uh, 94 that we have in the backyard. So guys, remember, like, share, subscribe. Make sure you guys pick yourselves up a t-shirt from the Nasty Addiction Garage Teespring account. Uh, so just click down below there are t-shirts there are sample of the t-shirts that we have there not all of them are on there but check out the uh, website guys you guys can look at the uh, description i'll have all the links down there but guys take care of yourselves and each other peace until next time separate facts from the fiction lift pussy what's under your engine any who we in that we flexing try fast got a nasty addiction separate facts from the fiction